captured on cell phone video the chilling moment that rapid gunfire broke out in Alexandria this morning. Shots being fired and there are people running, possibly victims involved. An all-out gun battle as Capitol Hill police and Alexandria officers engaged a lone gunman, 66-year-old James Hutchkinson, targeting Republican members of Congress who were practicing for a charity baseball game. Oh, we need medics. We got a suspect. Right by the baseball field from the YCA. There's also uh, a victim down in the baseball field. Among the first to be hit, Republican whip Steve Scalise. He's drug himself from the dirt infield to the grass outfield. Uh, there's a trail of blood. Uh, we can't help him. We're helpless. I mean, we're, we've got bats versus uh, rifle. Scalise's security detail and the Capitol Hill police immediately begin. Turn fire. The gunman armed with a semi automatic assault weapon and a handgun. He was crouched behind a wooden piece of um, stand, the stands and he had a AK 47 in his hands. He was exchanging fire with police officers who were crouched behind a black SUV. The six people injured include Congressman Scalise, Capitol Hill police officers David Bailey and Crystal Griner, Matt Micah, a lobbyist for Tyson's Foods, Zachary Barth, a congressional staffer, and Representative William. Williams, who twisted an ankle. Two of the Capitol Police were shot. Uh, one uh, staffer who dove into the dugout um, with a leg wound, and we got somebody's belt and put it around there to stop the bleeding. So we were tending to him as well as trying to keep down away from the shooter. Members of Congress said the gunman knew who was on the field. An individual walked up and asked, hey, you know, there's Republicans or Democrats. Jeff said they're Republicans. The guy kind of turned around and started walking towards the field. It was a little odd, but there was I, I didn't see any indication of violence or anything. Big fat guy, probably 5'8", five, 5'10", five, had a t-shirt, shorts, had, uh, had a long gun and a pistol. After an intense gunfight that shot out the windows of the next door YMCA, Hodgkinson was shot and wounded. He died a few hours later at the hospital. Meanwhile, all five victims were rushed to area hospitals. Representative Scalise taken off the field by medics, a police officer taken out by chopper. I never thought I would come to baseball practice for a game for charity, for local D.C. charities, and have to dodge bullets. Representatives who normally don't have security details grateful for Capitol Hill police who might not have been there had GOP whip Scalise not been on the field. They probably saved our lives and the lives of a lot of other people because because we were all sitting ducks, those of us who were in the, the dugout. Tonight, the FBI is handing out this flyer to people in the neighborhood. It is of the suspect, James Hutchkinson, asking for any information to phone in tips. In the meantime, it would certainly appear that this was a targeted assassination attempt on members of Congress. And, Lester, that goes to the very heart of the democracy. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.